Hi Cancer, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I'm here to do your reading for the month of April. This is for Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. We're just going to see what comes up. Keep in mind that this is for the month of April. It could resonate at any time in April. It may not resonate the moment you watch it. A lot of times I get comments from people that say, you know, when I first watched this it didn't resonate and I came back because I remembered it and it does resonate. So just keep that in mind. Um, may, may or may not be for you. This is for somebody who needs it the most. This is for somebody that's part of my tribe, but that's the way I feel. I mean, yeah, my re my readings do resonate with new people as well. Maybe they're drawn to me for a reason, but typically I I believe that my these energies connect with people that connect with me, right? Obviously. Cancer. What do we got for Cancer. Dear God, angels, spirits, and universe, authority. This is the emperor. This is taking the lead, being the boss, dominating, um, taking control of a situation. You're in control. Or this could be somebody coming into your life. I don't know. Um, this is about standing your ground and making a decision and sticking with it. Okay? Somebody has probably made a decision and they have made up their mind. Um... This, if you, this could also be somebody that's coming into your life. It could be. This could be. This is an emperor. This is the emperor. Okay. This is a very dominant man. This is somebody that is very strong. Somebody that can take care of you. Somebody that um, has a lot of wisdom. This could be you, Cancer. This could be you taking on this energy. This is a very wise individual who has the ability to take care of business. This is also somebody who you know, tries to make everybody happy, you know, tries to, um, he has a, um, well, it's like a character to uphold, you know, a reputation to uphold. So it's somebody that is very highly respected here. So this could be you or the person that is coming into your life, whichever, whichever, however that resonates with you. Um, but the way that I see this is that you have enough knowledge and you have the uh, authority and the wisdom to make the decision that is going to be best for you and the people that are in your circle. I feel like you are, uh, you have the power right now. It's like you have to make some sort of decision and it's a big decision. <laughs> You may hold be holding on to your stance, or you could be dealing with a person that is somebody that this guy looks kind of stubborn. It's like he knows what he wants, and he's not going to accept anything left less his mind is made up. This person, I'm saying his because it's a man. It could be a man or a woman, but whatever. I think it's a man because the emperor is very masculine. Anyhow, this person, um, their mind is made up. The mind has been made. The, the decision has been made. And that makes complete sense. It does make complete sense. Um, whew. Very highly respected individual, definitely. We have a very highly respected individual here with the Six of Wands as well. This is like a, this is a warrior, a very strong individual. So I'm not sure if it's you or the person you're dealing with, but this, this is some lack of truth justice reversed and this is dishonesty too king of swords reversed i mean we may have somebody that is withdrawn cold and they may not be telling the whole truth and they be <laughs> and they're not willing to budge i'm not no i don't know if it's you or the person that you're dealing with it's like somebody is standing in their power i don't know who it is Ooh, avoiding they're trying to avoid upheaval. And that makes sense. Because the emperor does not... He likes structure and organization. So somebody is trying to keep things together. But... It doesn't look good. I'm sorry. It doesn't look good. I mean, we have the lovers reversed. The tower reversed. The king of swords reversed. The justice reversed. 
There's somebody here that doesn't want to be held accountable of their actions. There's somebody here that is lying, okay? And you may be that you may know it if this is you taking on this energy or this is the person that you're dealing with. This person is it's like a poker face. I mean, that guy has a poker face. It's like <laughs> Somebody is trying to avoid upheaval, and it's like they're telling a lie, and you may know that. I'm not sure what this is, but this is the Page of Cups. The lovers reversed, and now this is a contract, and this is a contract right next to the justice. They're both reversed. Somebody may be lying on a contract. You know, they may not be telling you the whole truth. Just keep that in mind. There could be some legal issues in, in, a, in a divorce that are... That are you know, on the table, there could be some, some injustice here, somebody's uh, lying, but if that's the case, I'm here to tell you that, that the judge or the, the person that is making the decision, they are wise enough to know better. We got a very wise individual here that can see right through this bullshit, so keep that in mind. Um, Somebody may be coming to offer an apology, just saying, or an offer of love, and you know better. Somebody, it's like, I know better. I know better, you know. Um, two of Wands reversed. Suddenly, it's like all of a sudden, there could, you could be, you know, somebody could suddenly be arriving with some sort of news or some sort of message. Perhaps they're, they're going to pretend that... You know, they love you. I mean, I'm just being honest with you here. The lovers is reversed. Next to the justice, reverse. Be careful. Be careful because you could be dealing with somebody who's not emotionally available. You know, the king of swords reversed. This could be a bully. This is somebody who is mentally abusive. Just be careful. Be really careful, Cancer. Um... Somebody may not want you to move on. You know, they may not want you to take the high road. And so now they're deciding that they have to take back their power. I don't know. Yeah, somebody doesn't want somebody to move on. Um, six of Pentacles. So, Cancer, I feel as though you are being recognized in some way. Somebody is recognizing your potential. That's what it looks like to me. And I feel as though somebody is coming forward and offering you something. The Page of Cups next to the Nine of Cups, they're offering you something big. It's like, look what I have. I got all this. I got all this. You, you know, I'd like to share it with you. It's like somebody is coming forward with something for you, okay? Some, something emotional, something that you've probably been waiting for, right? It's like, it's an offer of love. It is. With the Nine of Cups next to the Page of Cups, it's like, you're obviously, it's an offer. It could be, it could be an apology, you know, maybe maybe um, now they they want to give to the sixth situation after blocking you or cutting you out or throwing you out. Okay, it's like some you know whatever. It feels as though you know somebody may want to um, reinstate a contract, and it's probably too late. I feel as now, all of a sudden now, they recognize, you know, that they want to take their power back. They want to bring structure back to a situation, you know. They want it back. They want it back. So I feel as though you're going to have to make a, some, make a decision. Do you want to get, this is a false foundation. This is a false contract. It's some sort of dishonest offer. I'm sorry, it is what, it's false. It's not true. I feel as though there's definitely been a blockage here. Somebody has blocked communication. They've blocked the truth from coming out. And now it's like all of a sudden they want to give to a situation. All of a sudden they realize. All of a sudden they recognize that, you know, this is where my abundance lies. I need to go back and get it. Now maybe this person has dealt with some bad karma and and now they see the light i mean this could be the case maybe this person got themselves into a false contract they got themselves into a karmic contract karmic contract okay 
And now perhaps maybe maybe they realize that they didn't treat another person fairly, that it was an injustice, and they want to rebuild the foundation. And that could certainly be the case. Somebody could be recognizing, you know, this is where my abundance lies, and I'm willing to do whatever it takes to get it back. So for some of you, that is the case. It looks to me like somebody is making a, it's almost like a sudden decision to basically take back control of a situation in which there was like a terrible injustice. It's like they want to fix it. They want to bring balance back to the situation after they've received some sort of bad karma. And it looks like whoever this person is, their decision has been made up. It's like they, they know what they want, and now you're going to have to make a decision. Interesting. Ooh. Ah. The high priestess reverse. Now, this person may have hidden agendas. They may have secrets, and maybe you know that. Maybe you know that. I feel like you're dealing with somebody who went through a repression, a karmic situation because of the decisions that they made and perhaps now you know they definitely see you as their wish fulfillment with the nine of cups next to the star cards like they see you as wish fulfillment cancer that's what it looks or you see them could go either way i mean this could be you you know having this epiphany or them having an epiphany somebody has some sort of uh offering of love it's like all of a sudden i too it's like all of a sudden you know i gotta do the right thing i gotta do the right thing and i gotta go after my dreams i gotta go after my wish fulfillment i know what i want and i gotta go get it i gotta take a drink hold on the star is hopeful it's a time of inspiration somebody may want to bring peace to a situation they just want peace in their life right they just want to heal the situation so I feel as though we have somebody that is trying to do the right thing, trying to do the noble thing. They're trying to, you know, fix something, a, a, a foundation that has cracked, something that has, you know, crumbled. I think that we have somebody that's coming back to perhaps do the right thing, um, whether that's you or not. Oh, God. Queen of Wands reversed. This is somebody who lacks confidence. There's somebody in this reading, whether it's you or the person that you're dealing with, that lacks confidence, uh, lacks courage, lacks willpower, lacks ambition and drive. Um, that could have been the karmic contract that they involved themselves with. Maybe it stole their energy and they just want to get their energy back. Um... It's like somebody's vibration has gone down and it's like <laughs> they want to bring it back up. Oh yeah, absolutely. They want to bring it back up. I feel like we have somebody, definitely a fire sign. We're dealing with a fire sign here for sure. I mean, somewhere in their chart, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Somebody wants to take back control. It's like somebody wants to do the right thing. This is nobility. It's like... After, you know, being in a state of poor, poor, pitiful me and, you know, not taking any action, not finding the willpower, it's like all of a sudden there's this big shift where it goes from weak to strong. It's like we have somebody here that has found their strength, I think very suddenly, very suddenly found their strength to go after what they want. Um soulmate connection and perhaps what happened is is they let go of a soulmate connection for a false contract and it's like now they want to take ownership of it you know i want to i want to take ownership and i want to fix this and it's like this person is willing to you know protect what they think is theirs i'm going to go after what i want Somebody may want a reconciliation, whether it's you, Cancer, or the person that you're dealing with. There's a reconciliation here on the table. Somebody may want another chance. They may be, you know, asking for forgiveness, you know. I really feel as though you will have an opportunity to forgive, whether it's you or the person that you, you know, the other person. There is an opportunity for forgiveness, for forgiveness here. There's an opportunity to, you know, reconcile with somebody, 
and I feel as though somebody needs, just needs to find the strength and the courage and the willpower to speak up, to communicate. Somebody could be receiving a call, okay, just saying a call that um, they've been waiting for and waiting for and waiting for. I feel as though there's definitely been a blockage here, and it may have been another person, okay, a false contract. I feel like somebody has realized that the grass was not greener on the other side, and they want to come back. And, yeah, that's the way I feel, Cancer. Whether that's you, you know, maybe you could be the one that feels that the grass wasn't greener on the other side. You want to go back to somebody. It could go either way. I feel as though um, there is an opportunity for wish fulfillment here, though, with that star card and that nine of cups. There's an opportunity for forgiveness. There's an opportunity to reconcile. Um, could be with the queen of pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Um... Could be with Scorpio. Could be with anybody. Uh, could be with an Aquarius. Could be with anybody. Okay, we have Lee, we have everybody here, so it doesn't really matter. But anyway, I feel as though somebody has thrown away a golden opportunity, and they want it back. They want it back. That's what this is. I know that's what this is. They want to stop over, start over. It looks like somebody's coming. They're hoping for forgiveness. This is an apology. Cancer, either you're giving an apology to somebody or somebody is giving an apology to you. And there's an opportunity to start over, to start fresh, to start from the beginning. You know, I really do. I feel like there's an opportunity for a reconciliation here. And I don't know who this is for. Um, hmm. Oh, now it's reversed. It may not be accepted. It may not be accepted. Somebody may feel like the other person uh, has a wandering eye and lacks integrity. You know? Or this person may not have the moral backbone to follow through, and that's the fear. Right? There's definitely been some, some bad... Somebody has received some sort of bad karma, and this karma that they could have received could have been financial karma. You know, karma will hit you in mysterious ways where it's really going to hit you and you don't expect it, okay? So I feel like somebody has had some sort of financial loss that they have brought upon themselves. This is karma. This is karma for the decisions that they have made. And now they have learned some sort of lesson and, you know, they've gained some wisdom and they, they want to fix. They want to fix something. Yeah. Somebody made a poor decision. Somebody did make a poor decision. They got distracted by... Who knows what? They got distracted. They lost their focus. They went down the wrong path. We have somebody here that um, was confused and indecisive and immature and probably had a self-image problem and was looking to feed their ego and got themselves, you know, they got themselves into a predicament to feed their ego. And now they've been brought down and they want to go back to their stability. They want to go back to their safety zone. You know, they want to go back where it's safe. I really feel as though <laughs> whoever you're dealing with, some per at least I'm not sure if it's you or the other person. We have a very immature individual here, somebody that is very childish. Absolutely. Somebody that is very childish that doesn't know how to save things that are worth keeping. I mean, we have somebody here that has chosen their ego and their pride over security. And now they, they probably want to come back. They do. They don't want... They, they do. They, they, they do. They want to come... I think that's what this... I know that's what this is. Whether this is you want to go back to them or they want to come back to you. It, it's like somebody wants to reconcile with the person that walked away. 
It's like they finally realize, I don't have anything to prove. I just want my happiness back. So, Cancer, I feel as though you may be receiving a message. You may be receiving a call. You may be receiving some sort of news that kind of shakes you up a little bit. It may uh, even make you upset. Or, or the other person may get upset. Somebody may get upset and, and, and end up blocking the other person. Or there's been a blockage here. Somebody that's already happened or whatnot. Somebody's definitely been blocked. There's some anger. There's some resentment that, you know, there's an opportunity to heal it, though, with the star card. There is. There's an opportunity for healing here. There's an opportunity for wish fulfillment. But in order for this reconciliation to work out, it's going to take equal give and take. It's going to take, you know an equal amount of effort on both parts. So there is an opportunity to, you know, gain from this situation and to bring balance and harmony back to this whatever it is. If if both people put in a lot of effort to to make it work, it could work. I feel as though there is an opportunity for balance and harmony. There is. There is, but somebody's has to do the right thing. They have to tell the truth. They have to come clean and they have to be able to follow through with their decision decision it's like you don't you have to prove it you know you have to earn that respect okay so there is and this is earn respect as well so i feel like there's an opportunity to i don't know what reconcile with somebody that really hurt you with this five of swords if that's what you want um But will it happen? It's like, uh, you know, I think there's a lot of bitterness. There's a lot of anger. There's a lot of resent. It could get turned down. It could get turned down. I mean, it definitely could. It could be like, you know what? I don't, I don't want to prove myself. I don't want to be criticized by you anymore. I can't deal with it. And maybe this person is realizing that they were too critical. Maybe they're realizing that they misjudged the situation. Maybe they're realizing that they weren't practical. And they just want their stability back. You know, it's like somebody just all of a sudden, I think it's like all of a sudden they want to give back. It's like they want to, they want to, <laughs> take the lead, you know. So I don't know who this is for, but that is what I see. Um, somebody's trying to do the right thing by the looks of things. It's like they are. They want to fix it. It's like they want to come in and fix the situation so be prepared i feel like there's an opportunity for two people uh, to reconcile whether it's you wanting that reconciliation or the other person i mean this could even be somebody from a past life it could it could it's safe for you to love open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all it is safe Somebody has gained wisdom through a negative karmic experience because they thought the grass was greener on the other side. And now they want to come back home. Flirt. Extend your light-hearted energy to others. One more card. I'm just going to show you what's on the bottom. Express your love. Go ahead and make the romantic gesture. You know what you got to do. It, or this is the person that's going to they're going to make the gesture towards you. I really feel as though there's a chance. For healing in a partnership. But it's going to take honesty and it's going to take courage and confidence really to face your fears. And somebody hasn't been able to face their fears about rejection. So anyway, Cancer, I feel as though, you know, you probably... 
you know, will receive some sort of message. We have the Page of Cups, the Page of Wands, and the Page of Pentacles. You're going to receive a message. Could be an apology. Whether you're the one apologizing or they're the one, there's an apology here. It could lead to success. It could lead to victory with that six of right with that six of wands right on the corner there. Looks like we have a masculine that is about ready to or is in the process of or has made a decision. A masculine. That's what it looks like to me. We have a masculine that has made a decision to come forward with the truth. And that's what I have, Cancer. That's what I have. Good luck.